Hola amigos! It is I, El Presidente Quill18, back with some more Tropico 6. Oh, look at this low rebel threat. Yeah, see, we've dealt with that. Um, this is our communist tourism place, where the tourism is actually going here. Uh, we're actually in a pretty good situation. Our new power is up. Uh, we're fancying our housing for people. Right now, the housing happiness is fairly low. Now, I think what we're going to do, we're not going to run free housing, but what we're going to do is take care of these guys. Yeah, some poor people. We need more tenements. Uh, some David tenements. So all these homeless people can live there. Um, oh, hold on. Am I running urban development? I don't think I am. Cancel, 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 cancel. Let me build up a little bit of cash for a sec. Okay, there's, there's some cash. Run urban development. Thank you. And then we're gonna rebuild these bad boys. Sorry, just demolish all your shacks. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep electrifying these. And there's actually another uh, uh, building mode we can throw on here, which seems like it's gonna be a good idea. We got the stadium request too, but we'll, uh, I think we're gonna be fine there. A couple of you. Oh, no, no funds. Okay. Well then, there we go. There we go. Hopefully we don't go like crazy negative here. I think our money's okay, as long as we don't run like free housing. European aid sends or European Union sends some money. Thank you very much for that. So, with our tenements. Uh well we'll have to electrify some other, but there's the arm taker mode increases housing quality. A decrease is crime penalty, crime safety penalty. So, because I think the tenements produce crime safety, like, problems. Increases upkeep by some, but that is going to improve the housing. So now the housing quality is up to 63, which means anyone who goes into a tenement will come out with housing happiness. That's enough to raise this sum. We can increase the uh, the maintenance of some of these things as well. But mostly, I think, moving people in houses and doing this is going to be okay. Let's electrify everything. That'll include things that are under construction. Should be affected by that. They should also have the... Well, they don't have the new mode. I can smell a deal in the wind. Okay. So, they didn't get the new mode set, but I think they did get the electrification set. We still have the stadium. This area is going to need a... Grocery... Oh, I think we don't have garages over here. That's actually going to be kind of annoying. Parking deck. There we go. So people can move around again. All right, hopefully we don't go too deep in the negatives. I think our economy is still in pretty good shape. I think our housing is going to be okay. We can use a convincing talk for the stadium, but we could also build it. What I might do is I might stop some housing development for a little bit here. Especially since we still have to do some upgrades to these buildings. Have you seen the stock price? I came to see you as soon as I found these were available, President. You know, I'll buy another stage distraction. We'll use one of them for the stadium. Thanks for your help. And President. I'll take the money. And we still have pretty good approval overall. No real worries there. I think the parking decks can get an upgrade here. Yeah, um, surveillance cameras to decrease the crime in the area. That's actually very handy. So electrify all of these and set everyone to armed caretaker. We have a power shortage. Wow. So... Oh, I can't build this right now. We need a bit more cash. 18,000. So I need to be at 8,000 to be able to plop it down. Blueprint for office. I mean, that's another great way to make a ton of money. Come on. Am I spending too much on my buildings? We could cancel the armed caretaker at some point. Although I still kind of like the idea of it. I think it's probably pretty useful for us. Okay, yeah, our money situation is fine. Not a problem. It's official. We have a drought. Water rationing begins immediately. In other news, it's bath day for El Presidente's favorite white elephant, El Nelly. Presidente, it is so dry, the dogs are my... Uh, 
chalk lines. I would conserve water for residential buildings. I know it's gonna hurt some of our industrial buildings, but hopefully they'll hopefully we'll have enough money to make it work out. Use a little housing over here. Okay, our housing is done. Okay, for now, I'm gonna go back to normal maintenance on these tenements, but we might go back to armed caretaker afterwards. And there's no reason not to upgrade this. It's so cheap for that extra 10% boost. Might need a little housing here, but people are satisfied with the housing. Um, I guess, I mean, I'm gonna have to unlock it, but we'll unlock the modern mansion. It's fairly cheap. We still have the policy running as well. So, go here near that research center. Wait for the heat wave to be over before we expand uh, some more. How's our employment? Not very much unemployment. So rapid expansion might also be a problem. Um, we might want to change our immigration policy. I don't know. You know what? I want them to stay here. Teamster's office affected by drought. Yeah. Well, we Good well... news for those dying of there you go, heat wave. Oh, that was short. Oh, we're fine. Easy peasy. So dry. Doesn't water seem extra wet? <laughs> water seem extra wet. We need to process you again. Jeez, these garbage dumps are brutal. Um, I'm kind of okay with getting the. I don't Our know. money's at work, Brent. Maybe let's just go for the tourism. Let's just see if we can finish this. I think that's actually okay. Although I am liking this game, but then I can start a new one. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, let's bring this a little bit more. Get a few things ready to go. We'll get a uh, parking deck ready to go in the middle here. Drone delivery. Delivers all types of goods. So replace some of our Teamsters. Drone taxi. That's kind of cool, too. Um, let's get a construction office over here. We'll get a little town sort of kick-started. Um, so we're going to get... Well, let's put an actual shopping mall. Because that also does what the grocery does. Um, we'll have a cathedral. We'll get a hospital. Uh, what I'll do is I will quick build the construction office. Also upgrade you. Might get another airport. I get both airports with metro stations. They can connect to each other. Oh, I don't think they connect between islands, actually. Now that I think about it. I don't think that's something that happens. We could do electric substation. I'm going to do is and build it here. I know it doesn't extend as far as it can, but it keeps it sort of out of the way. <coughs> Drone economy. What use is power if you don't I'm going to not do the building edict, although it would give us a bunch of Swiss bank account money that we could use for other things. We could do a little more food production on this island just to deal with uh, uh, transportation times, but... Our food happiness is good. Crime safety is the lowest at 54, and that ain't bad at all. Um, I think our... Oh, no. Urban development's still running. A couple of proper apartments, and then some tenements for the people who can't afford to live there. tavern over here. Okay. Dun dun dunzo. Now that this is set up, mostly, just let a little construction, a little more construction finish up. Uh, have a second shift. Well, let's wait on that. Oh okay, yeah, so under tourism, we're gonna get a tourist port on this side of things. I think I'm gonna get another airport. I think it's fairly loud and polluty. Um, you know what? Here, done. Okay. Well, that does go down, and then we'll build a ton of hotels and things, which should let us hit our cap. We'll have to, you know, pair it with 
like plenty of entertainment as well, but that is part of the plan. Oh, I don't have enough money for the road. Okay. Okay, now I do. So, entertainment, actually. That's tavern, restaurant, uh, let's arcade over here. Fast food joint. Then we'll get on some fancier stuff soon. I could heist another world wonder. And we need to build the cybersecurity thing. Actually, I I've heisted this and I never put it down. My bad. So let's get uh, let's get you over here. Everyone will be happy to visit St. Basil's. You saw it in that Tetromino stacking game from the 80s. Now we <laughs> see the real Tetris. thing as St. Basil's Cathedral miraculously appears in Tropico. It's a miracle, indeed. No other reason why it's here. Just totally a miracle. Alright, we need some cash before I keep building. Hopefully I haven't, like, built up too much infrastructure and not enough money. Alright, I think we're going okay. No nope, homeless over here right now, which is nice. Well, maybe this airport... Uh, oh, no, we don't have the modes. Uh, duh. That's still fine. Alright. Let's go nuts. We'll build some... Uh, oh, skyscrapers. They have to be rich for that. I mean, we might still want to do a mix. Let's do economy hotels... Next to the airport. Loud and uncomfortable. Tough. And then we'll pair this with some decorations. Ooh, including some from DLCs. I'll press sign. No, I don't know. I want, like, the big parks. Something like that. And then we'll build some uh, proper hotels on the other side. So cheap hotels, proper hotels. I like that. Needs an upgrade. Could air condition it. That might be okay. Oh! I didn't realize we get cool music when we click on this. Alright, come on. Give me money. Money, money, money. Yeah, freighters are still not bringing in tons of cash, but it doesn't. It probably doesn't help that we don't, you know, we don't export, like, particularly valuable goods. Done. There's probably some upgrades for these we might want to tweak. First of all, what kind of modes? Oh yeah, full room, half room. Hmm. Yeah, we'll increase the efficiency in exchange for upkeep. I mean, theoretically, we are going to be making money off these things, so it makes sense. Um, I think we might want another parking deck, say, over here. Power shortage. Ooh. Well, that's no good. The citizens are demanding elect. Of course, I will deliver an amazing speech. Uh, housing happiness is the lowest. We'll praise. Uh, we'll praise the religious. We'll blame no one. Uh, am I gonna promise to improve anything? And I could promise to improve. I'm not gonna promise to improve anything. We're still gonna get elected. It's gonna be fine. My tropicans. My Easy. Because it might be hard to get housing to the next level. It might be... I mean, it's possible, but it might be expensive and just annoying to do it. Other nations look to tropical with a barely concealed jealousy. That is fully warranted. We have all the best landmarks, and they keep carelessly losing theirs. We do have some pretty good landmarks. And what are um, people? I feel your pain when your walls shudder and your roofs leak. Those of you who have roofs. But soon, roofs for all and walls for many. As we strive, God shall not forsake our beautiful shores. Our spiritual friends get to realize we could get some solar panel windows to uh, reduce our power demands. Time now for the Canal Uno 
business news. Oh, and we have no research happening. Export free drug prices with the US and Europe fell today after they discovered that the poisonous spiders, which were occasionally found in the <laughs> them, were being added deliberately. <laughs> Deliberate poison spiders. Yeah, all right. Ooh, money's, uh, money's a little tight here. We really don't have super valuable trade ships happening. So are we actually making more money on tourism than other things? The answer is no. But we are making money from tourism, so I guess that's still a thing. In the past, I will take the money. And now that we have the cybersecurity, um, we could heist something else. Edicts are cheaper. Uprisings do go somewhere else. Efficiency of plantations. Tourist vacation time and tourist fees are increased. That's what we want. Definitely heist that. I will repeat cue the treasure hunt afterwards over here. Um, actually, rather than that, we're going to repeat fantasy reviews so that we get good tourist ratings. Not every nation is Tropico's friend, Prez. Not like I'm your friend. We don't need to sabotage anyone. There you go. Solar panel windows on these things, which will again help with the power. We probably built, built a new power station, so of course we're going to want to make sure to upgrade that as well for the 10% power boost. Okay, we have tons of extra power now. That's good. Plenty to spare. Okay. Money! Where's my money? Tourist planes are bringing tourists. Now these guys are probably going to want more things to entertain themselves with. There's a couple of shacks. Well, maybe just the one. I thought that was another one. So we'll need some more housing in this area soon. Positive money. Oh, we're almost at the uh, the tourist amount for the win. We could legalize substances. That's a good way to bring in more tourists. Right? Tourists pay an additional $1 each time they have to pay a fee. Increases liberty by 10. Increases thrill-seeking tourists and relaxation tourists. Decreases religious standing and conservative standing by a lot. But we're going to go for it. Drones undergo repairs right now and again. Hmm. Drone economy. Increase the construction cost of all drone-related buildings for five years. You act with great con Take the cash. We probably will hit 400. Well, I mean, it's possible we don't have the space for it as is. But I'm guessing we get close. Fishing ground is overfished. Can I, can I zoom to that? No, really? I mean, we got a forefather style for like, you know, not overdoing it, but automated mines done. I'm sure the good citizens. We don't need to adjust the ballots. Although we only have 65% support, but we are going to win the election fairly handily anyway. We might have some trade exports we can be doing. Jewelry, hides, jewelry, fish, coal, gold. Oh, well, we do produce some gold. We might export coal. I don't know. Okay, we're out of the trade thing, so that's going to be okay. All right, let's plop down luxury hotels. I was going to do normal hotels, because we actually may not bring in, like, that many super ultra mega rich ones yet. Farmers say we love paying for seed grain every year. Put in some luxury ones, because actually we do bring in some rich things, now that I think about it. So we can slap you in there. I forgot the cruise ships are actually just accommodation. Yeah, they're very convenient for that. And then we might want more tourist activities just to make money. Scenic outlook over here. It is actually pretty with the parks. Feels a little bit silly. Election is a landslide, Presidente. The metaphorical kind, not, not the kind that accidentally reduces the I size. We'd of already the put these in place. Had it not hit confirm last time? Maybe it didn't hit confirm. You have done it, Presidente. Hey, we are, the victory is ours. We have 400 people currently here. Nice. Well, 
there were some rough periods, mostly because I was, I'm still goofing around to make a, a better story, but maybe, maybe there should be a little bit more effort applied to uh, not letting things go absolutely batshit insane as often. Travel warning for Tropico. Well, see, now that's just rude. Um, we can, uh... Where's the shortcut? Oh yeah, over here. So Russia's not keen on us. Oh, I can't praise them. That's too bad. Oh well. Oh well. So they don't like that we've taken over the role of the uh, the true communist nation. They're just bitter. We will need a lot more power if we do that. Okay, so far so good. We will need some more housing though. Put that up. Maybe a couple of tenements over here as well. In case people can't afford that. That's more housing we need in this area right now, but probably we'd be building more things. We don't have a fire station on this island. Actually, I don't think we've got one on the uh, the other tourist island either. Is it not under public services? Oh, yeah, there it is. We'll build it here. We'll quick build it. We can also upgrade you to have a helicopter maybe after. But for now, we'll just give you the high water. Pressure jets. High pressure water jets. One of those words. Shut up. I can totally word you guys. <laughs> Maybe we won't. Um, we have one of these. I don't remember. Do oh, yeah. There you go. We can just send a helicopter there. Now, as long as we've got one somewhere. I mean, we could upgrade more of the fire stations to have the helicopters. But as long as we've got one somewhere, we can go ahead and do that for increased speed. We'll give you those windows so you use less power. Maybe we'll go ahead and we'll electrify the tenements so they're nicer. You're looking magnificent today, we President. We are doing the fancy review raids already, so that's going to happen regardless. And yeah, the castle. Policy to tell we finally have running. Tell you what, let's run it and see how many people... Two gorillas. Or... Anyway. We really, there's like no threat. We are so secure, no rebel threat whatsoever. Everything is great. We finally have achieved our little bit of our paradise. We still have more room that we could expand to, but I think we will be wrapping it up. Oh, and then all of a sudden we have a massive power shortage. We may have more buildings that use more stuff. Um, order, man. Solar panels. We'll just keep going crazy with them. I mean, we do get a lot of power from the nuclear power plant. And we probably have enough uranium production, but these we literally can just build as many of these as we want, you know? Here, I'll build another one just to say that we've got it. Care less than Teamsters aren't bound to the road network. Limited charge, recharge periodically, and sometimes they crash. And you get the cargo export, and you can set this up instead of our docks as well. We unlocked it really early from a raid, and then I was like, eh, whatever. Now, true Tropicans can relax. If nobody is looking at you funnily, you must be a good person. <laughs> I like funnily. It's a perfectly cromulent word, but it's very entertaining to say. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, no new tourists on that last plane. But in theory, our um, tourist rating, you know, it's there. Things are happening. And then if we just put down more buildings, they would feel really good about it overall. No filthy rich permanently exclusive permanent exhibition. Oh, cultural tourists instead. Neat. And then we have tons of money, so you go and like put down a ton of like fanciness. Uh, and actually the entertainment stuff here is pretty filled up, so it'll actually be quite nice. Uh, we can get some gourmet restaurants. Nice gourmet restaurant over here. Uh, cocktail bar. Build a big golf course. There we go. I'll stretch this out a bit and do something like that. And we just keep the tourists happier. Mostly, I was just uh, trying to bring this episode to a normal length so that no one sees the video length and they're like, wait a minute. Here, let's trash that. I think it's stupid. Hate having to reset that all the time. So annoying. That garbage dump. Maybe there's something else. Maybe there's something I'm missing about it, but I don't know. Alright. Well, folks, we finished another run of Tropico 6. I still love this game. You can still expect some more in the future. But for now, I got some other things I want to be doing. 
But uh, I don't think it'll be too long before we have another game in Tropico. I'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.